The federal government came into this crisis with an emergency stockpile of supplies and a big unanswered question. Will it be enough? No, we likely did not have enough. I think federal governments for decades have been underfunding things like public health preparedness. And uh, I would say that obviously governments all across the world are in the same exact situation. In the exact situation and now all trying to buy the exact same things. There's a global run on the masks and gloves that every health worker needs. Supplies are being rationed in Canadian hospitals and are becoming increasingly hard to get on the market even when you think you have a deal. There is a whole saga behind the scenes of inventory that doesn't exist, of orders that disappear and quite frankly of deliveries being um, purchased from underneath us uh, at the plane by other jurisdictions outside of Canada. Those market conditions emerge as some provinces scramble. Hard-hit Quebec has burned through a year of supplies in a single month, showing just what the country is up against. Health systems were never designed for this kind of surge, and so that is that is the challenge. This is precisely why the government has signed deals with companies to make these supplies here in Canada. That global competition will only increase and it's becoming more and more difficult to rely on other countries for help. David Cochran, CBC News, Ottawa.